Yo, what's going on, guys? We're back. What up, boys? We made it till Friday. We made it to the next promo. This week was a little... It's Oh, wait. Every week right after Zero Chill is pretty much like a ghost town. That's the way it's always been, but we made it through it. Campus Heroes today should be getting some good cards, rolls, packs, sets. We're going to go into everything last time they released Campus Heroes earlier on this year. Some good methods. The Reggie Bush set was just over and over and over. We were rolling like crazy. Ended up with a ton of end cats. Hopefully, it'll be that good or close to that good today. But we will jump into everything. See what all we got, man. Greatly do appreciate everyone. Drop a like. We got underdog lines that are going to be set up today for tomorrow's game. We got good NFL games on Saturday and Sunday. So make sure you guys are jumping on the underdog link. Code SCOMO will double your deposit up to $100. This is the weekend to get in, boys. This is the weekend. Last week of the NFL season before the playoffs. Get the money stacked up, ready to go. Going to be some really good bets for the playoff season, too. So be ready for all that, boys. I'm ready. We're pulling. I'm, I'm rolling a lot of training today. Let's get it. EasyMutt.com. Fastest delivery, 100% safe, instant refund, cheapest price around. Code SCOMO, 5% off. Best way to get the coins, to get the cards you need to win. Let's get it. Yay! Campus Heroes Volume 2. Very creative with putting the two on it. We have Brian Arakbo, Percy Harvin, Amon Green, for the Packers theme team, there's a lot of like crazy names in here. Ahmad Rashad. I mean, I think everyone was kind of surprised about that. Bruce Matthews that can play the entire offensive line, but does only have the one theme team, I think. Billy Joe Dupree, Cowboys theme team. Sam Bradford. What did he call them? Matt Bradford, Matt Stafford. I don't even know. I love you, Kralo. Brandon Sprikes, uh, Anthony McFarlane. The Giants got Van Pelt. I might check him out. He's covered, though. Kind of different, disappointing. LaVon Landry. Tatum is pretty much what most of the people are going to be going for. And then our underclassmen. Fantasy pack. Between the two, I think there'll be a few people that'll go Arakpa. Percy Harvin being a route runner. Theme teams. Yeah. Percy. Percy. Probably going to be the move. You need three of the 94s you can put in any three and then you get a fantasy pack of your choice of three back end cat so you do get the three back end cat all right that is all the set we move on can you test the rolls to see if they're glitchy i don't open packs around here we're kind of like anti packs around here i don't know this might be the first time that you ever been here but yeah we really see my pack the packs don't even show up on my account they just know like don't give scomo packs campus hero final exams we do get an end cat right we do get an end cat from this we do get 85 overall plus campus heroes so that makes me think at 40 stars you have a chance to pull a 94 if you ever if you ever get to 40 stars and you get this and you get a 94 tweet at me i want to see if people are pulling 94s out of this 85 plus that'd be cool but you do get a, a 94 end cat so the one out of the 40 stars could be a sellable one if you get lucky on that so do your solos and you can get the xp you need to do these solos these are going to help me out for the xp 90 stars will get me the end cat and then if you go all the way to 140 you can get two more chances at the 85 plus campus heroes it'd be cool if they like sneaked in a campus hero limited today what would give me suggestions 96 overall campus hero limited if you worked at ea what would be the fire what would be the fire that you would drop today surprise be like bam 96 overall campus hero limited player is johnny manzel oh that'd be fire even though we have 9 million scramblers and everyone's using Derrick Henry, Johnny Manziel is like one eighth the size of Derrick Henry. It'd be okay. It'd be okay. A lot of Johnny footballs. Desmond Howard, Denard Robinson, Eddie George, Eli Manning. I like it. Charles Woodson. Charles Woodson, probably like the best recommendation that I've seen. Oh, we 
got packs. Campus Heroes 2 pack. 20 times Hero 2 bundle. 30,000 coins. Campus Hero 2 pack. 85 plus at a thousand is it gonna let me open it does not will it let me open the point pack it does not and let's reset all right dollar 50 pack 150 points let's see what we get here let's see what we get here campus hero 2 give me a full one give me a full one animation is the same 85 and that was our pack that was our pack anthony mcfarland on the 85 let's see what else we got let's see what else we got so we got these that are only up there this is the early bird bundle so this is only up there for 24 hours 94 overall 15 hero pack so if you are gonna buy the bundle this is the bundle you get one of the guaranteed 94s for sure probably gonna go in on that let's just check out the second campus heroes pack this is basically the exact same thing we just opened up for the 150 points let's check out second one of these just to see another 85 popping i would keep your eye out also for different power-ups today see if that jalen hurt starts popping out a little bit more we have 85 plus campus hero 2 players 2700 training 2700 training seems a little expensive seems like it's either gonna be a big win or a big l because 85 is quick sell for 710 training 710 training seems like a big difference so let, let me let's just figure this out these were 85 plus and you can get 94s and 95s out them these are 85s and you only can get 94s but why are these more expensive why why weren't they the same price they should have been around 1950. you can get 89s i am seeing some people pulling some 94s a lot of 85s come on come on let me see a full one 85 how many rolls do you have getting an 85 before you got to get a 94 and it's still a dub that's the math what if you quick sell it every time you lose still like 1300 what is it Woo, make rights will come boys make rights will come probably around like two three four o'clock later this afternoon all 85s are popping straight out of this you lose 2000 training but then how much are the 94s 94 billy joe dupree back out real quick see can we get a back window window give me another one back to back i want it i want it i want it no all right we got one we got one right there billy joe I want to see we're gonna to go to the binder check him real quick look at the stats see what he's selling for just want to see if i can like what you got to get 194 like what every 10 rolls every like eight rolls that would be a dub right you can get one like every eight rolls would be really nice hold one roll got two players that's fire dude and live and no issues 94 brad van pal we got the giant so that's we started with what about 130 i think i had 130 140 000 training we have two 94s and we're about 50k in but i haven't quick sold anything i haven't quick sold anything all right let's check it out let's check it out everything we'll come back to we're gonna come back a lot more rolls later today we'll get back to that if it gets super hot let me know all right so let's just see what we ended up there real quick with i didn't quick sell any of them did i quick sell maybe one maybe two if someone was paying real close attention let me know that was 5 10 15 20 25 26 maybe like 27 28 rolls or so somewhere around there i maybe quick sold one or two if i did 
that would give me 55,000 training. We would be at a little loss. A little loss. But we did get 294s out of that. We got the Billy Joe. Billy Joe is going to be one of the good theme team ones that you would want. 91 speed, tight end, Cowboys theme team going for about... 218,000, 200K. They all about 200K. I'm, I'm guessing they're all about 200K. Brad Van Pelt, all, all about the exact same price. We got these other 85s, which I could turn that almost in to another 94 if I wanted to, right? Because you need 30 of those. So minus the two means I have 24 85s. So that means six more rolls, I can get another 94. That's not bad. Because then you're going to get the other cards back as Nat too. Right? So let's just see like what if we did this real quick. So if I go here and I roll this six more times, right? I do this six more times. Maybe I pull another 94. If I don't, I'm going to take all these 85, put them in the set which is going to give me another 94, which is going to give me three 94s, but then it's also going to give me the end cat cards back also. We're going to complete a set here in a second. 85, that's two. This is going to be number three. Give me a 94. Let me get lucky. Let me get lucky. 94, Brandon Spikes. We got lucky. There we go. Now this is definitely going to be a dub. Now we're going to end up with like 494s. There we go. Big dubs. Big dubs. But like one more. Five. One more. I think this one. This is an 85. We're done. All right. So now the animation different from the 94s not that i noticed maybe more flags and fireworks like we're about to find out real quick when we do the set so let's see here you think i should do a harvin yeah i might as well do everything right so that is all the 85s going in it doesn't really matter what set you do unless you want the power up oh you do get the power up is there any power up going for more you do get the 94 back when you do the set but you can make some good coins from doing the power up so Right now, chat's telling me Landry from the power-up, but depending on when you do these sets, just see what power-ups have the value. Do that set. That's what you want to do. All right, adding that to it. This is going to be Laron Landry and his power-up. So you get that and that. You get the 82 power-up, which is selling for... One sold for 55,000 coins. All right, so that, that gives me Laron Landry. So now we've spent about 90,000 training. 90,000 training is going to give me 494s still. You only need three of them. Um, I'm going to put in U3. They're all the same, right? Does Laron or Billy Joe sell for more for the 94 by itself right now? I mean, it's so early. I'll put in Billy Joe in. We'll try to just sell Laron, I guess, maybe. So now we got Percy Harvin. We're about 90,000 training in. We got Percy Harvin and these Nats. So I'm just curious, right? So we take both of these. And then I can take... Who do I want to take? Van Pelt. Tatum. Brandon Spikes just to look there. And maybe I could sell one of my middle linebackers. That's a lot of coins because I'm really not using that. It's kind of what I want to do. The move for me is to get Brandon Spikes, put him at middle linebacker, and sell one of my expensive-ass middle linebackers that I'm not even using that's just there for looks. That's what I'm doing. Boom. This is going to get me like 400K. All right. So... Now I want to see something just for just curious reasons, right? Training value inequality is what I want to see. Once again, 90,000 training basically. And what did we end up with? 90,000 training. I have a 94 Laurent Landry left. We got the Percy Harvin and then the three end cats, which is another 70,000 training. So that's not bad. 
I don't think I ended up bad. We got good with our rolls. I was able to sell that power up. I have this Laron Landry that I can sell also. Percy for 15. Now I just got to sell everything. I think this actually worked out pretty good. I think this actually worked out pretty good. Route Runner with 95 speed. The only thing, once again, is just he's another 5'11". Like, I have so many good wide receivers that are under six foot. I need him to be like 6'2". I need him to be like 6'2", but I'm going to keep on rolling. We're going to see if there's anything else, but not bad. Not bad. This will hold us over. Playoff promo better be way better than this. But this is this is okay for a time. This, this is a hold. Hold. Hold.